One dog owner was shocked when he picked up his toy and felt a prick. It's led to the callback of the toy. Gail Ong gives us the latest. This is the needle that it wasn't Oliver, one of Oliver's toys. Israel Sacedo says he found the needle as he was playing with his dog Oliver at their Concord home. Started to like squeezing it to get the squeaky, um, make the squeaky noise because Oliver goes crazy over it. And then I pinched myself really hard on my fingers and I was like, ouch, it really hurt. That's when he said he found the sewing needle coming out from inside the toy. I guess it was pretty scary for us, especially because Oliver, oh Oliver, he is, uh, we love Oliver and I got so worried that he could got, you know, hurt. The toy was purchased at a Pet Food Express store in Concord. Sacedo and his spouse immediately contacted a store manager and they say the manager contacted the manufacturer. A spokesperson for Pet Food Express sent a statement to Cron Ford that reads in part, quote, We are so grateful that no pet was hurt. While we have never had an incident with this manufacturer, we are directing our stores to remove the product from their shelves until we can be certain that the product is safe. A statement to Cron Ford from the manufacturer, Patchwork Pet, reads in part, quote, Safety is our number one priority. Never in our 13 years of business have we encountered a safety-related issue like this. Required procedure is that all toys must go through metal detection prior to packaging. The quality control team is investigating and will make any necessary corrections. Sosedo is thankful for the full response from both companies and just wants to spread awareness to other pet owners. That means always checking toys for Oliver before playtime.